As we approach the highly anticipated Special Delegates Congress of the NPP taking place in just about 48 hours on Saturday, August 26, the Elections Committee has extended an invitation to all 10 aspirants. Now, this open-door policy aims to address any concerns these aspirants may have prior to the election. In essence, all T's are crossed and all I's are dotted. We understand five of the aspirants have chosen to visit the party's headquarters where they were meticulously reviewing their preparations, ensuring that every detail is in place before the big day. Well, some want to receive their accreditation for their agents and if the committee also has any information for them. And so there isn't much uh, coming from them as of today. As part of the process, we have said that we'll be working with the aspirant into the elections. And so the, the doors of the committee uh, are still open for consultation. In the run-up to the Special Delegates Congress, the Elections Committee has issued a clear caution to all delegates that they refrain from publicly displaying their ballots. The step is vital as the MPP underscores the act of publicly showcasing cast ballots is considered a criminal offence. We've said and we've placed strong emphasis on it that no delegate should make any attempt to take photo of where the person would have voted. And if anybody gets to that stage, the security will take charge of it. With these measures firmly in place, the MPP seeks to reassure all involved parties, from stakeholders to delegates, aspirants and the general public, that the party's protocols are designed to safeguard the secrecy of each voter's choice, ensuring that no individual can discern the voting preferences and patterns of specific voters once the voting process concludes. As the countdown continues, the MPP says it remains committed to upholding the integrity of the electoral process and maintaining a level playing field for all the aspirants. Our delegates will do the needful, will comply with the security arrangement put in place, cast their votes at the various centres and return to their respective areas. And then when it is one o'clock, the EC will do the honour of uh, opening the ballot, sorting, uh, counting and then recording uh, to all the candidates the figures they, that they would have gotten. And so we are set. Noble Crosby Annan, NPB headquarters, Accra.